world's fastest half mile, Bristol Motor Speedway, definitely at the top of the list for NASCAR. What's up guys? It's Bristol baby. We're here in Bristol, Tennessee to watch the Food City 300 as a personal guest of NBM Motorsports. So come along for the ride. Today we have a special treat for you. We're going to take you behind the scenes with NBM Motorsports. We're going to talk to all of their drivers, take a look inside the garage, watch them practice and then later tonight we're gonna watch the race all right so i'm here today with lucy and timmy hill timmy is a driver for mbm so kind of wanted to say you know what's a normal day like for you here at the track so uh a normal day here at bristol is a uh, jam-packed a lot of action and a very very busy weekend for us uh, this particular weekend nascar's all three divisions are here the truck series uh, the Xfinity Series and the Cup Series. So just a lot of on-track time. If we're not on track, there's another series on track. So uh, at Bristol, I ran the Truck Series and Xfinity Series here with MBM Motorsports. And uh, for me, I'm in the car a lot. I I'm in the car practicing the truck. I'm in the car practicing our Xfinity car. And which is nice because for me, going into the Xfinity weekend with MBM Motorsports, I get more track time versus other drivers that don't get quite as much. So that's been a big plus, but at the end of the day, it it's, it's a big help for me. That's awesome. And as a driver's wife, well, I gotta ask, what type of prep preparation that you have? Well, you know, when I'm able to come to the track, and I love being able to come and support Timmy, we wake up, we get ready for the day, and we'll go to get a nice breakfast, which is Timmy's favorite meal. And then when we get to the track, we'll um, come in, and if there's any type of qualifying going on, and then, of course, there's race day ceremonies, and we'll get ready for the race, and that's the day. That's awesome. Watch the race, yeah. And, you, and you've been with NBM for a while, right? Yeah, so my racing crew in NASCAR has been nine years. I've been with MBM going on my fifth year now. So most of my NASCAR career, I've been with MBM Motorsports. Uh, so it's been a, a big blessing to kind of have a family wrap their arms around me and stay with them this entire time. That's awesome. Well, I definitely hope to get a second interview tonight in the winner's circle. So good luck today. Thank you so much. All right, so we're here with our next driver from MBM, Tommy Jones. So Tommy, tell us a little bit. We've been asking everyone today, how did you get started in racing? Yeah, so I've, I've been racing now for good grief out here in the NASCAR world about 10 years, but it really started in Mississippi where I'm from, little small dirt tracks running go-karts with my dad, and it's kind of progressed all the way up to kind of what you see now. Uh, yeah. So it's been kind of a crazy scene to see. And now being in Bristol, Tennessee, this is, kind of one of those tracks that's like close to home. It's between this and Talladega is kind of the home race. And so this is one that I, I look forward to coming to every single year. That's awesome. And today you're driving the uh, Diamond Gusset Toyota, correct? Yeah, exactly. This is another kind of special thing here being in Bristol. Uh, this company here, Diamond Gusset Jeans, they've sponsored me uh, since 2014. Uh, and I was terrible in 2014. <laughs> we ran a family team there for a little bit there in the Xfinity Series and we were Boy, we were bad, uh, and so they, they stuck with me. They've stuck with me ever since. They're actually from Bon Aqua, Tennessee, which is on the other side of Nashville. So this is a home race for them. Uh, it's cool to have them on the car. I got another uh, kind of uh, Knoxville-based company, AEN Adjusters, there on the hood. So it's like Tennessee companies here racing in Tennessee and, awesome. and me from Mississippi. So this is kind of the homecoming here for everybody. That's excellent. Well, thank you for your time today. Good yeah. luck tonight. Appreciate it. Thank Thanks, you. man. So it's only the second practice of the day, and it looks like someone already blew an engine or something. I don't know what happened, but you look behind me here, the whole track shut down. They stopped practice, they're cleaning the track up. There was oil and water all over the track. Man, it's only one o'clock and it's already exciting. So we're here with another MBM driver, Chad Mitchell. Chad, tell us a little bit about how did you get started in racing? Man, I've been racing for many years. Uh, I actually added it up the other day and I think I've counted 18 years. So I'm 24 years old and I started racing at a very young age. Um, 2001, 2002, I was second grader in elementary school playing ball sports at the time and uh, decided that I wanted to be a NASCAR driver. Um, I 
mom and dad was always a huge NASCAR fans. Uh, my grandparents were huge NASCAR fans, and I had followed that. And so at a very young age, we started. We found a guy who was selling some racing go-karts and racing equipment. Went and talked mom and dad into buying it. We went and bought it, took it to our first race, entered our first race, and actually won it. At first, it was just a hobby to take place of school ball sports, but over time we were very successful at it and we had people telling us and guiding us saying, hey, you need to do this or come and run this car and uh, one thing led to another, man, and I started out on dirt and I've made my way up through the ranks and uh, been running for MBM now for a couple of seasons. That's awesome. So you say you've been with MBM for a couple of seasons. How long exactly have you been with them? I have. So I started the uh, NASCAR side of my career in 2012, went in the championship at King Sports Speedway in 2013 and backed it up in 14 and then had a, a former NASCAR Xfinity Series driver, Eric McClure, when he retired from driving, he actually opened up his own team with his best friend, Hal Martin. So I went and drove for them, and our first race was here at Bristol Motor Speedway in 2016, and we won that race. Oh, wow. So that propelled my career. I got to meet Carl Long and uh, Johnny Jackson and was able to form a relationship with them, and uh, my, I started my career off with them about halfway through 2017. And uh, So this will be my second full-time season with MBM Motorsport and uh, we're having a good time. Um, we've improved a lot throughout the, the period that I've been here and uh, we actually just earned our career uh, best Bristol finish earlier this year in the spring race so we're looking to build off that here tonight. Well, excellent. Well, thank you so much for your time. Thank you. Good luck tonight. Appreciate it. Thank you so much. Guys, what an amazing ending here at Bristol. Timmy Hill coming in seventh place, a great finish for MBM Motorsports. Guys, give Timmy Hill a follow on Instagram at Timmy Hill Racer and MBM Motorsports at MBM Motorsports. So on behalf of MBM Motorsports, thanks for watching.